What up guys? What up our nation? I'm back with another video and this time it's going to be a different video. It's going to be something that I'm going to explain what happened uh, with me uh, way back and two weeks ago and yesterday. Um, if we get this video to 10 likes, smash the like button, subscribe if, you, if you're new, but if we get this video to 10 likes, um, needless to say that I'm going to go do a fan meetup at Sammy G. So all my Sammy G people get ready because this is going to be a very, it's going to be a fan video that I'm going to make once it get to 10 likes or if it doesn't get to 10 likes, I'm still going to, regardless, I'm going to still do a fan meetup at Sammy G. Um, this all started two weeks ago or a month. This started a month ago. Uh, I played with a new Ouija board and people told me a Ouija board is not to mess with um, and needless to say I messed with a new Ouija board and guess what happened um, before I got possessed I encountered a ghost um, I really didn't know the effects on the Ouija board could possibly be uh, very 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 dangerous um, Okay, so I put my two hands on the cursor and I was asking the Ouija board, are you a boy or are you a girl? Um, what was your date of birth? And all those questions that, that just came from miles. And, and guys, I know I'm terrified from this day, from today, from yesterday. But I played with the Ouija board and let me tell you, 50% worked, 50% didn't work. So 50-50, um, for me, in my ends, yes, it did work. Because, like like I said, it's it's very scary. Needless to say that I got scared. I was terrified. I dropped the Ouija board. I put it aside. I told myself I'm not going to play with the Ouija board. After playing with that Ouija board, I encountered two ghosts in my in my room. Um, it was a black uh, figure with red eyes. It, it looked at me and this demon was called Zozo. Um, Zozo is a very dangerous uh, demon that could possess you and in a way where it can control your body. And this is very scary because once it controls your body, you cannot be around people. You cannot be around... Uh, your friends, family members, all that. So it really freaked me out. Uh, yesterday, um, I was watching TV. I was watching Law Order. I was watching TV, and this is this, this is why I'm telling you. Like I I was watching TV yesterday, and something triggered. Uh, I think something triggered my phone, or something triggered. Oh, that scared me. Guys, I'm talking about a ghost story right now. What happened to me, like, I, I encountered a, a demon and the light just turned on and this is a reflection light. It's just, guys, I'm alive. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, but it is what it is. Um, yeah, so it just switched by itself. Um, I did not touch the remote. I did not touch anything that was beside me or around me. I, it, it just, it, it was... It freaked me out because I woke up, I fell asleep, I was sleeping on a couch, I woke up and I, and I remember before falling asleep I was watching Law Order, remember, I woke up, oh my god, that freaked me out, the light just, outside the light just, boom, like you know those movies where the lights like, turns off, turns back on, there's something behind you, that's the type of thing. Uh, anyways, so I remember watching Law Order and as it, it switched to Gossip Girl, so somebody told somebody something to, something happened. So anyways, it was very terrifying. I can't even speak. I'm so speechless right now because this is the type of thing I tell I tell everybody to not play with a Ouija board or do not mess with a demon or do not mess with a spirit. A spirit because when you mess up with a spirit, excuse me, when you mess with a spirit. And it could cause you more damage to your body. Uh, I have a doll in my room. 
I don't know why I have it in my room. And every time it looks at me, it's creepy. And it looked at me once. Um, it's a true story. Uh, it was laying on my desk. I have, I have a desk in my room. So it was laying on my desk. And I turned around for two seconds. The doll, the doll uh, um, turned the head like automatically. Like alone. And I encountered some personal, uh, permanent activity. And, and let me tell you guys, I encountered so many ghosts in my life that I don't want to get flashed by. Every time I rem like every time it reminds me, it freaks me out. And this is why I'm, I'm telling you guys about, if you watch my recent video, I was explaining how I got possessed. And this is not how I got possessed. How I get possessed is that one day, I was looking at the mirror for straight one hour. One hour, like one hour. When I saw the shadow with the red eyes, this is remind me. This is what I encountered. I encountered a a, a white a, 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 a girl with the white with a white dress. It freaked me out because I was watching uh, Mo Sarji and hit in one of his videos. There was the girl with the white dress, and apparently the girl in the white dress is is a spirit thing. You know, like it freaks me out. You know, and every time, every time, um, I, I, like, I, I, I feel like in danger. I feel super, 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 super. It freaks me out even more. Um, I just want to say before I end the video, I just want to say you shout out to my Bolex. I love you guys so much. It's your boy, Jay. I'm out. Before I go out, smash that like button if you did enjoy this video comment down below what you want to see next if you guys want me to continue with this storyteller spooky stories let me know in the comments i love you guys our nation i'm just sparing the love to all my fans out there and i just want to say an important message do something with someone you love i love you guys peace